understanding damn and hell in English. Hello, everyone. Today, we're going to explore two commonly used English words, damn and hell. These words are often heard in movies, TV shows, and daily conversations, but their meanings can be a bit tricky, especially for English language learners. Let's dive into their meanings, usage, and nuances. Damn is a versatile word in English used in various contexts. At its core, damn is a verb that means to condemn or criticize severely. However, it's often used as an interjection to express frustration, disappointment, or anger. For example, you might hear someone say, Damn, I forgot my keys, which shows frustration. Damn can be used in several ways. As an interjection, damn, that was a good movie, to emphasize, that's damn good coffee. As a mild curse, I don't give a damn, showing indifference. Remember, while damn is a milder curse word, its appropriateness depends on the context and the company you're in. Moving on to hell, which originally refers to a place of punishment in the afterlife in various religious traditions. In everyday language, it's used more broadly. For instance, what the hell is a common expression of surprise or frustration. Like, damn, hell is used in different contexts. To express surprise, hell, I didn't know you could sing. For emphasis, it's hot as hell today. In rhetorical questions, why the hell not? It's important to note that both damn and hell can be sensitive words, depending on cultural and religious backgrounds. In formal settings or among certain audiences, it's often safer to avoid these words. I hope this video has helped clarify the meanings and uses of damn and hell. Remember, understanding the context is key to using these words appropriately. Happy learning, and see you in the next video.